for the key, I got ignition Run your mouth, but I never listen You hold me back, we'll never last Keep talking all your shit Wondering how all this started You left me broken heart. Hey guys, it's Take Impact and we're back again with another exciting video so we have got the Mi A3 in our hand and we wanted to share a few tips that have stood out to us as we have been spending some time with this device. So grab a snack, settle in and let's talk Xiaomi Mi A3 tips and tricks. Let's start with the new gesture navigation. This is the default navigation option that you can find on your Mi A3. If you swipe up on the home button, you will have your recent app menu. Swipe up again to access your app drawer or slide to the right to swap between all of your open apps. Flick right to swap between the two most recent apps. You can close an app by just swiping the app from the recent app menu or tap on the clear all option. Next up we have a secret menu called system UI tuner which is actually hidden in Android Pie. To enable that menu, simply install this app on your Mi A3. You will find the link in the video description below. System UI Tuner is one of the only tools that you can use to modify the status bar without rooting your device. There is a new way to get into the clock app quickly from any screen. While in the quick settings menu, if you tap on the time in the top left corner, you can launch the clock application. Similarly, you can get into the battery menu by tapping on the battery icon in top right corner. If you want to run two apps simultaneously, you can do so with a feature called split screen. To get into split screen, while you are in a recent app menu, simply tap on the app icon at the top, select split screen, then choose the other app from the below list and you are good to go. Next, we have a security feature called Lockdown Mode, which will lock your device, hide all of your current notifications and require your passcode or pattern to unlock your device. Other authentication methods like fingerprints or face unlock won't work when you enable Lockdown Mode. You might use this feature in situations like at night when you are asleep. If someone tries to unlock your device with your fingerprint, it won't bypass the lock screen until you manually enter the passcode. How about changing the theme of your Mi A3? You can manually change the theme of your device by heading to settings, then display. Here under advanced menu, you will find that option called device theme. It's not gonna change the entire OS theme, it's only limited to the notification panel, app drawer and some other areas. Whenever an app is open in a landscape orientation, you will find a rotation icon in the navigation bar right next to the home button. Simply tap on it, the app will rotate itself. You no longer have to manually switch auto rotation option on and off to rotate the screen. You know there's a shortcut for taking a screenshot. Just tap and hold the power button, you will get a shortcut button to capture the screen. A trick to make your phone feel faster than it actually is, is to remove the transition animations. To enable that, simply head up to the settings, then tap on the accessibility menu and turn on this option called remove animation. There's a button based shortcut for silencing your phone. Simply press the power and volume up button together, it will switch your device to vibrate mode. You also can change the shortcut action by going in settings, then system, gestures, then tapping on this option. Here you will find another option to quickly launch the camera application from any screen. Simply enable it, now you can easily hop into the camera application even from the lock screen. Do you wanna make your device less destructive at night? Just swipe down the notification panel, tap on this edit icon, add grayscale shortcut in your quick settings. Whenever you toggle it on, the screen will turn into black and white.
Next up, we have accessibility menu that provides easier to reach shortcuts for performing some functions like pulling down the notification set, locking your phone screen, etc. To enable it, open settings, tap on accessibility, then inside accessibility menu, turn on this option. Do you know, the default keyboard app has a very useful feature, which is a clipboard. So any text you copy will be saved inside the keyboard app for a limited amount of time. However, you can also pin any copied text inside the keyboard. By tapping on this G icon on your keyboard, you can easily access that clipboard. Lastly, you can customize the home screen on your Mi A3 by changing the icon shape from default circle to some other predefined shapes. To do that, long press on your home screen, go to home settings, tap on this change icon shape and choose any icon shape of your choice. Isn't it cool? Anyways, that's been Xiaomi Mi A3 tips and tricks. Hope you guys liked it. Make sure to subscribe for more awesome content like this and thumbs up if you enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.